bon à venir faire une gossip non hein yes And the effects that it has on people psychologically, emotionally. And a lot of times when you're in it, you're not aware of it until you step back. And you realize that. And that's been happening with a lot of other victims that have been contacting me. <laughs> Just recently today, I've heard from two other victims that... <sighs> so it's just a lot to talk about. That experienced the same thing that I experienced, they were younger. <clears throat> and it's very hard to talk about these things because most of the time people get overshadowed with the gift of that particular person. You know, oh, they're so gifted. They're a great singer. They're a great preacher. Oh, look what they did for the community. But gifts and callings come without repentance. And two of the offenders were not only a victim of grooming, as what I described in some of my previous um, videos, but of SA, sexual assault, from the same predator that groomed me and that violated me as a man they're going to be pressing charges and as much as this is an uncomfortable conversation to have especially with people who don't know what it feels like so it's kind of hard to be in someone's shoes and other people who say well why now why now because they don't understand the emotional the psychological effects that it has on someone I know two of the victims which shared their story and went through very similar things that I went through with the same predator are ready to press charges and they said that they will press charges. This is ministry. And this is what it means to bring healing to the brokenhearted. Because stuff that people held in for years, they're finally able to speak and to be heard. Okay, guys, as you just saw that video, now this is allegedly one of T.D. Jake's victims. Um, I wish this full story just comes out because i am really tired of tidbits of stories and not the full story um, but allegedly this is one of his victims and he is um releasing some information and there again um some more rumors are swirling that there's more victims and again as we go into 2024 at some point we need some hardcore evidence again there's been a lot of information that's been coming out um they continue to say that there's going to be lawsuits at this point they should probably just come out with the lawsuits or we're gonna have to stop talking about it because at this point we, we need some more information so again um this guy's name is don't get me to lying i don't even remember his name because i literally um saw the story a few hours ago and i'm getting ready to head out and i wanted to go ahead and drop this video for you guys but he calls calls himself prophet manasu and i could be saying his name wrong guys um i could be wrong again i haven't had any time to do much of any research on this this was actually reported by another blog um and i'm going to give you guys the name well that's the blog i think it's north carolina beats if i'm correct um so again 
we're still in the same place with the rumors, um, alleged rumors with regards to T.D. Jakes. There's also been some photographs released um, that I may come on here a little bit, maybe tomorrow, and share with you guys. Really, that shows him sitting on the table with his legs folded. Very odd picture. Um, so as we, you know, go into 2024, which is um, pretty much tomorrow, I'm just wondering when is the full story going to come out again? We've been hearing so many pieces of information, um, so many allegedly, so, so much information that is, you know, supposedly came from his church um, and the church members. Um, but at this point, um, we're, we're ready to see, um, see all of the evidence or all of the information or whatever lawsuits that is stated to be coming out. We actually want to see this information come out um, because I don't know how many times we can talk about this story and the information coming out without it actually coming out, if you guys know what I mean. Um, but yeah, as I stated, I would bring you the information as it comes out because you guys definitely stated that you wanted to hear it. Now, let me just give you my, um, where I am in this. Again, I don't have any facts of anything either. Um, but again, I have known about this pastor. I have heard things for so many years. Um, again, I don't know what goes on in that church. I don't go to that church, but people are coming out, church members, and you guys have sent me information with regards to Michelle Loud. Um, and I am just watching those videos and I am like taken back. And that's kind of like a whole nother video, but just on basically the little information that I have found about this family, something just doesn't add up. And again, you guys have sent me information. I want to shout out Monique Johnson. Um, I want to shout out Sharon Smith. Um, who else? Um, Osiris. I can't even pronounce his last name. Um, so you guys send me stuff all the time. Um, and I really, really, really appreciate it. And I know you guys are really so interested in the Michelle Lau Michelle Lau story. I've been listening and I've been listening. I'm gonna watch some more videos. Um, you know, I totally understand Michelle, but there is some she's gonna have some issues with that, just based on the little stuff that I heard, and I could be wrong just because of the time that has passed. Um, so I don't know very much about it. I'm gonna like continue to watch some videos and see uh, what I can find out about that. But as far as this is concerned, this is all the information, the most updated information I have with regards to T.D. Jakes. Again, there's another video that's been posted about him. We can talk about that tomorrow. Again, I wanted to share you guys the information. I am on my way headed out. You guys have a safe New Year's Eve, and I will see you guys again tomorrow. Make sure you like, share, and subscribe to my channel if you have not already. Um, and make sure you're following me on social media platforms such as Facebook, Instagram, and TikTok. And also, you guys, I have a second YouTube channel is which is my backup channel which is lakeisha lakeisha tv follow me there as well um and i will see you guys in the next video